Expectant mother Vasha Jane says she stays indoors in New Delhi to avoid breathing the toxic smog covering northern India. Her husband is equally concerned, worrying about their child growing up in such polluted air. On Tuesday, she and many others in northern India woke up to another day of severe pollution. I don't step outside the house, I walk around inside my house, eat healthy, and we also have air purifiers at home so that we breathe fresh air. So these are the precautions I take. There is concern for the baby. If this is how the situation continues, how will things be in future? However, my doctor has given me good guidance of staying at home. Also, there is no other way but to face this situation. Each winter, India faces air pollution as coal air traps dust, fumes, and smoke from illegal farm fires in Punjab and Haryana states. On Tuesday, New Delhi's 24-hour air quality index was 488 on a scale to 500, according to India's Central Pollution Control Board. It says 0 to 50 counts as good, and anything above 401 as severe. Swiss experts rank the Indian capital as the world's most polluted city, with air quality classified as hazardous. The government has been forced to restrict vehicle movements and construction activity and has urged schools to hold classes online. This week, the country's weather department said that a shift in the fog towards the northern state of Uttar Pradesh had helped improve visibility in Delhi. Local media reported that strict measures to reduce pollution have slowed production at over 3.4 million small and medium-sized businesses in Punjab, Haryana and Delhi.